There it goes. Literally, the only thing my wife and I ever fight about is how muddy my boots are because I always drag them through the house. But today, that's not going to happen because I'm putting them on by the door. What we're gonna do today is go and see what Dan Van Linsky's up to at the school property because we start classes next week and it's so busy between moving to the warehouse, all our new products, the knives, everything, it's crazy busy for me. So I sent him to do what I normally get done and we're gonna see how that works out. Somebody is here actually doing work. Unbelievable. I know. Does that look like work? That's eight hundred three nine zero nine. The big conversation with myself was, uh, did you get anything done? Um, yeah, actually I did. And what were you doing? I went down and uh, I think I made an executive decision on putting the classroom down there in that bottom section. Mm. Well, so, I made the executive decision last night. We're not moving it. <laughs> ah, so I did all that work for nothing? Yeah. Peachy. Yeah. Yeah, I had to stop. I had to get some lunch. I was getting weak. Oh. I'm on work. I was drunk. Current status is we're trying to figure out exactly where we want our classroom. We always had it here, but then I got on this kick that I wanted to move it to another location. Dan cleaned out a location. That's what we were just looking at. And then I was like, I don't like that location. So I don't know. We're just like, what are we going to do? Home sweet home. You want me to go get rope and we'll try to pull that thing down? Yeah. I mean, that has to come down one way or another because we started all the nav courses back there. Yeah. We'll do that. Mm -hmm. All right, let me go get the rope. This, my friends, is our current situation. We just got to get that down. It was busted up last year, fell more. We don't need it on fall on somebody's head. So we got to get that out of the way before we clean up the rest of the area. Good news, I have rope. Bad news is this is the rope I have. <laughs> so listen, I think if we just pull it and turn it around, plus here comes the muscle. Bringing it. Um, I think all we're gonna do is just throw this over that and just pull it. It should be, I mean, it just hung up on that tree. Yeah, all right. So, hey. Now the gun show's coming out. <laughs> it is warm out. I know. All right. You're just saying, ah, I can't wait for a little bit warmer weather. Yeah. Now it's really warmer. Yeah, weather. now it's brutal. All right. You hold this. Don't let that go. No. Two wraps, one, two around the hand. I don't know if that's going to reach up. Or... We'll try. If it doesn't reach, then we'll, uh... you know what? So after a fall in the mud that the camera missed, a few curse words, him flipping out, me flipping out, we basically got the trigger set. So you could see right here, the edge of that broken tree right here hits that tree now. So because of that, that's what we're saying the trigger set. When we pull towards this guy, it should come down. Alright, maybe the trigger's not set. Alright. 
bringing in the big stuff now. We just have too much stuff to do. We can't keep messing around. <laughs> Bring it on the heat. We'll go off this little tree back here because this is... Crank it, Valens! Keep cranking! It's not going to go, it's not going to go there, we're going to have to reposition. There it goes. Yeah! Ooh! Yeah, get it done. Hey! Boo! <laughs> <laughs> a bit of muscle. On a scale of like 1 to 100, pain in the ass, this is 100. 15. At least that tree's down. That tree's been bothering me for two years, but finally it was in a position to take it down. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Ooh. Let's cut one of these down now. <laughs> hey, yeah, okay. Oh, by the way, he has a chainsaw on the truck. All right. 